I was originally introduced to the IICF by Rick Gulliver, one of the founding board members of the Midwest Division based here in Chicago. Uh, we jointly brainstormed the concept of an associate board and after putting it into motion, it's now been replicated across all of the other United States-based divisions. I first became involved with the IECF back in 2011. Um, I joined the executive director, Kim Saccaro, Rick Gulliver, and Kathleen Savio, and it was that core group that really started the Midwest Division. It's really great to band together with other folks in the insurance industry and to really make an impact on nonprofits that do such great work and they're just starved for resources. Also, it's great to be part of a movement to brand the insurance industry as being very philanthropic, which it is, and to really lean into that discussion about how you can use philanthropy to, to, to kind of help uh, the industry rebrand itself and, and really spend time having fun with, with other people that have really one common bond and that is to do good. I think another really powerful aspect of the ICF is it brings around colleagues and different competitors and communities together to really forge and unify and I think it brings the realization of the strength we have together and united than we do individually. The IICF has a profound effect on the local community and one charity I'd like to highlight is Lazarus House, a homeless shelter that's been in existence now coming up on its 20th year based in St. Charles, Illinois. Because of the graciousness of the ISCF, they've granted nearly $50,000 over the last five years towards this one charity that's been their, one of their largest single contributors outside of the state and federal governments. Without the IICF, Lazarus House would not be what it is today. I have a very special memory of one of the Week of Giving um, events and that our early literacy initiative that we instituted a few years back, Every Day is a Reading and Writing Day, was a great opportunity to get involved with one of our local charities, to go into the community where we were going to prepare these materials to see the children that would be impacted by it. Really neat opportunity to sit down with them, read through the material, engage with them. I think it was a real eye-opening experience of the value that we are bringing and the opportunities we are going to create for many of these young children who wouldn't otherwise have that opportunity. I think it really speaks to the importance and value of the IECF. The IECF means a great deal to me personally. Um, it's helped advance uh, my relationship with many individuals in the four corners of the insurance industry. It's helped our company uh, grow. And when I say it's helped our company grow, what I mean by that is that we endeavor to be a progressive company. We want to be collaborative, we want to be fresh, we want to be entrepreneurial, we want to be focused on organic growth, attract and retain talent. And the new millennial generation, to attract those folks, they care about philanthropy, they care about causes, they care about being involved in something larger than just investment banking or insurance. So as a firm, uh, for us to give our employees the opportunity to be part of something that's, that's truly meaningful, more so than just a career, uh, to take care of their family is important, but to extend that to take care of their local communities and be involved with something they can be proud of has really helped us uh, kind of frame out our culture and it's helped us attract and retain talent. The IICF has really frankly changed my life. As a young professional that's been in the insurance industry for 11 years, I had been searching for a way to give back, especially through an industry that had given so much to me. The IICF was that vehicle. Introduced to me by Rick Gulliver, the founder of Hub, and his involvement, I saw what a difference it can make when people in our industry come together to make a movement for change. And truly, the IICF has changed thousands and thousands of lives, not just in the Chicagoland area, but across the United States, where over $25 million in grants have been given back to the community since the original inception of the IICF. I know I'm just a small part of that here in Chicago, but it's great to be part of such a great organization.